in the information age, asking the right questions is critical. And this book includes questions that people can ask their doctor. Uh, asking most of these questions to a doctor during your regular visit might incite an adverse reaction. I am not giving medical advice. If placebos cannot be designed to test for both efficacy and safety, then large-scale efficacy and safety trials must need to be split up. This could simply look like the three-arm trials that the Turtles book suggests, and I agree that the safety arm of the trial should not be one-tenth the size of the other arms. The safety arm must also be scaled to identify rare adverse events before a vaccine is given to hundreds of millions of people. Reading through counter-arguments for Chapter 1, the facts seem generally agreed to, but the interpretations and ethical rationale diverge greatly. There is a giant gap between how industry-supported scientists and physicians evaluate the certainty of safety data compared to those who are industry-silenced. The establishment ethics rely on the assumption of safety, an echo chamber, and circular logic. They claim the existing vaccines have already been proven safe and effective beyond genuine uncertainty, and this validates their ethical paradigm that designs vaccines' clinical trials. But informed and skeptical scientists and parents are challenging the certainty of existing safety science. Skeptics have been complaining that there is inadequate data to prove a net benefit. Based on these different conclusions from the vaccine safety data, skeptics disagree with the industry's ethical paradigm. We demand more safety-focused placebo data, orders of magnitude more.